Hi everyone. Excuse my appearance. I just woke up. It is currently 7:54. I've been up for about nine minutes. I woke up at um, 7:45. Today is Friday. It's the last day of the online school week, but I do have quite a bit of things to get done today. So I did want to take you all around with me for a productive online school day in my life. So yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so last night I made a cue list of everything that I have to do today. I have to do a call with my teacher, an art assignment, a science exam, a history exam, and a math exam. And then I have to do a Chinese assignment and a bio assignment. Okay, so now I'm going to go and get ready for the day. Okay, so I just finished getting ready and I wanted to show you all my outfit of the day. My top is this tie-dye pink Floyd shirt from Target and then I'm just wearing some plain black joggers from Pink and then I'm just wearing plain white Nike socks and no shoes because I'm inside the house. Okay, so it's currently 9 a.m. and I've got a call with my teacher scheduled for 9 a.m. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. Okay, so I just finished doing the call with my teacher, now I'm going to head downstairs and make some breakfast. Okay, so I'm back upstairs and I've gotten my breakfast. I made a smoothie bowl with frozen strawberries, frozen peaches, and some almond milk. And now I'm going to begin my schoolwork. The first thing I have to do is this art assignment. I have to read the lesson and then I have to answer some questions about what I learned from the lesson. So I'm going to go ahead and do that while I eat. Okay, so it's been a little bit and I finished doing my art assignment. Now I'm going to study and prepare for my math exam. Luckily, this exam is open notes, so there's not too much for me to be worried about. So I'm just going to go ahead and review my notes and then take the exam. So I just remembered that there is a practice test available for me to take. So I'm going to go ahead and take the practice test instead of just spending time just reading my notes just to assess where I am. And then depending on what score I get on the practice test, I'm going to go ahead and review the areas that I need to work on. Okay, so I finished taking the practice test and now I'm going to just review it and see what I need to go back and review. Okay, so I finished all of my reviewing and I'm ready to take the exam. I am starting to get a little bit hungry, so I think I'm going to order some Chick-fil-A and then while I'm waiting for it to arrive, I will take the first part of this exam since it is broken up into two different parts.
Okay, so I finished ordering the food. It actually took a really long time because at first DoorDash wasn't working and then Uber Eats wasn't working and then finally I was able to place the order through Grubhub. Now I'm going to go ahead and begin the exam. I'm kind of nervous but at the same time I am able to use my notes so that's good and I think I got it. So let me just start. Ooh. Okay, so I just completed the first part of my math exam. I'm feeling pretty good about it. I mean, there wasn't really anything that I was too worried about. Like, there wasn't anything on the exam that I was like, oh my gosh, I don't know this. So I'm hoping that I got a good grade. And my food is about to arrive, so I know that between now and the time that the food is going to arrive, there's not going to be enough time for me to start and complete the second part of the math exam. So right now I'm just going to prepare a little bit for my next exam, which is my history exam. Okay, so for my history exam, there is a little review lesson that I'm going to go ahead and complete. And then after I'm done completing that, if my food hasn't arrived already, I'll go ahead and review my notes. Okay, so I just completed the review lesson and I got a notification that my food has been dropped off outside. So I'm going to go ahead and get it so I can eat. Okay, so I just got my food and now I'm going to eat and I'll catch up with you guys after I'm done eating. Okay, so I'm back upstairs and I finished eating. Now I'm going to go ahead and complete the second part of my math exam. Okay, so I just finished the second part of my math exam. It was pretty good. It was only three questions, but it was all um, word problems and like three part word problems. So um, now I'm going to go ahead and take my history exam. Okay, so I just submitted my history exam and now I'm going to review for my science exam. Okay, so I just finished reviewing all of my notes for the science exam and now I'm going to begin taking the actual exam. Okay, so I just finished doing my science exam and this one was probably by far like the hardest out of all of the exams that I took today. I think I did okay, but there are some things that I feel like I wish I would have reviewed a little bit more. So now I'm going to do my Chinese assignment. Okay, so I just finished doing my Chinese assignment and that literally didn't even take that long. It took about five minutes, honestly. And now I'm going to begin the last thing I have to do today, which is my Bible assignment.
Okay, so I just finished doing my Bible assignment. And I'm so glad that I was able to be productive and get caught up with all of my exams and assignments. Okay, so now that I've finished schoolwork, I'm going to go ahead and start planning for next week's videos. Okay, so I just finished planning what videos I'm going to be filming and uploading within the next two weeks. With that comes the end of today's video. I really hope you all enjoyed me showing y'all a productive online school day in my life, as well as a little bit of a study with me. If you enjoyed today's video, please feel free to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys again next week. Bye!